pitch, down the ground, fourth. Well touched there, yes there is. It's taken, Sammy gets the big wicket. A hundred for Travis Head on the biggest of stages. Just now, the uh, uh, whole team went to Narendra Modi Stadium and I just came to see them. We are cheering for India here. India and Australia has been been a great contest. We played the first game of the World Cup, so a lot of the guys on the other team are, are, are colleagues and friends of ours when we play the IPL. We know them really well, they know us really well, so it's going to be a great contest, like I said, and we can't wait for it to get started. You guys are five-time champions and going against two-time champions. Do you feel like you are the favourites? Uh, don't know about that. Um, I think it's yeah, it's going to be an even match. Um, yeah, the good thing is I think we've got six or seven guys that won it in 2015. Um, so we know that feeling. Yeah, you know, won't be afraid to go out there and. Uh, be brave and take the game on. In sport, there's nothing more satisfying than hearing a big crowd go silent, and that's the aim for us tomorrow. The nation wants to know whether, uh, whether the team is calm, quiet and composed for the final. Playing for India is as good as playing any World Cup game because there's so much pressure. At the airport, you're going here and there, World Cup jeetna hai, ye karna hai. I, I've seen guys starting, started to wear headphones now so that they can keep the noise out. Uh, but it's nice, you know, we've enjoyed our journey thoroughly till now. Uh, so yeah, just one final push Thank now. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, um, My role tomorrow is TV, so uh, there will be some simulations we'll do in a while. We hope we get a lot of flat lines if they say not out. <laughs> <laughs> the human element will be in cricket forever, I would think. Uh, technology improves, but uh, you need the, the guys out there. Same now to Roland. To get selected for a World Cup final, a game of this magnitude, it, go, it will go on your performance during the, uh, the tournament and also your performance throughout the last 12, 12 months and also sort of the reputation that you've gained over the, uh, over the pre previous nearly 15 years now. With umpires, the more that you can keep your emotions uh, in check and, and at a calm level, then the better you're going to be doing your, uh, your job on field. Got a few. 
we are very much excited. We are coming from Kerala, uh, and uh, we are sure that India is going to win. But I probably want Australia to win actually, because Indian team is very overrated. Overrated. We booked tickets you now long back, a month back, that India will be into the final, and we make adventurous trip. I actually waited for two hours twenty minutes. And I, you know, logged in from six different devices, and one of the device I get the chance to book. OZ, OZ, OI, OI, OI! India, India, India! Come on! Come on! It only takes one day. Today, India is going to win. Virat Kohli is our goat. It's pretty exhilarating, 130,000 Indian supporters and only a smattering of Australian ones. Home team in a World Cup final, it is going to be extraordinary how loud it gets out there in the middle for the toss. We are in the biggest coliseum in the world. It's the gigantic Narendra Modi Stadium. And coming up is one of the biggest heavyweight title clashes in recent times. Australia have won the toss and they have decided to bowl first. It's just 20 seconds. It's 20 seconds of the two captains with the trophy. Come in. Are you doing your own little video here? Or yeah. Play of the final in 2003, 20 years later, here you are, Ricky. 20 years later, 20 years I believe later. that. Yes, Predictions? Sir. Oh, I want Australia to win. Um, you know, Sorry? India have been the best team oh, in the tournament, no Absolutely. doubt about that, but, you know, what's happened in the past doesn't matter on a day like today. I'm dressed as an avatar because it's aliens for blue. Down the pitch, down the ground, four, first boundary off the bat of Rohit Sharma. And more intent from the Indian captain. In the air, gone. First wicket for Australia and Stark, a massive moment. Shubman Gill goes. And a hush round the ground. Up, floaty. Put in the slot and put into the crowd. First boundary for Kohli. A miss up, finally a miss up. Could this be a moment? Could it? One of the great catches under pressure you will ever see. My goodness gracious me. Is that a match turner? That was a play. How good was that? That was a great catch. Well touched there, yes there is, yes there is, Australia on fire here. They've got three in the first 11 overs, India are reeling a wee bit in front of their own full house. They've been silenced for a while and everyone suddenly saying yes we are here as Virat Kohli gets his fifth consecutive 59th half century score in this tournament but his job is just about begun. India trying to wrestle it back. The Australians are doing a great job to cut things down. Their fielding's been excellent. Oh, he's gone here. And this is a massive blow. There's the boundary that we were anticipating. Oh, good ball, good ball. And Kale Rounds long, long vigil is over to a beautiful ball. Oh, went for the big one, went for the big one, got the edge. Stark picks up another 2 1 1 for 7. That should be taken, and that's the last flicker of hope. Absolute heartache in the crowd. I think uh, Australia will be delighted, you know, winning the toss, fielding first, restricting India to 240. India ideally would have liked something like 270, 280 on the board, but still, it's runs on the board in a final. Anything can happen. There you go. Okay. No deal. 
Okay. Q-Cast. No stewie due yet. So how long it's you bloody good. No due yet, no. If it actually is due, Australia are red-hot favourites for this run chase. Away we go. A minute swing, edge, the two slips. Say it's yours, it's yours. Edge taken. Shammy gets the big wicket. He's had a wonderful tournament. Mohamed Shami has been an absolute threat to left-handers. He averages four, just the economy of three, and you can see why. He got Rachin Ravindra early in his spell against New Zealand. Got seven that game. Warner looking for the one that's wide. That's a very good catch. It's like the ball sourced a bit as well. Mm, got yeah. the toe in, not it? Yeah. Oh, that is big from Mitchell Marsh. Silences the crowd. Finger goes up. Little edge from Marsh. Boomer breaks through. Australia lose their second. Coley's pumped. The stadium's pumped. The whole of India is pumped. Got him. Smith goes. Boomer did something different. He's tearing the hole in the Australians. Lovely shot. All the way for six for Travis Head. Short ball to Travis Head didn't work. We're leaving because we travelled from far and the match seems done. India is probably losing in all Saturdays, so we're we'll going home. Travis Head, yeah, great effort for him. And Martin Slavishai as well. Beautiful shot. He's just gone a little fuller. Needs to hurry! A hundred for Travis Head on the biggest of stages! He joins the legends! Travis Head lifts it up now! So he's still looking for the big moments, even though it looks like Australia is in a comfortable position. But this could all turn in with a couple of wickets. And I also start looking for some dejection in the field. Oh, superb shot this. Great timing and a great way to bring up a half century. He's taken his time, but it's been such an important innings. So just two needed. Field spread out. They're all waiting in the dugout. Come on, come back, come back. And Australia win the World Cup for the sixth time and in front of 120,000 people. They've upstaged the home team in magnificent fashion. And the party begins. I'll keep a beer at some... I'll have a beer at some stage. I mean, just I'm like, just so proud of the boys. Um, what an innings from Travis Head. That was incredible. I don't think anyone sort of gave us a chance today, everyone thought India would win at home, so um, yeah, really special to do with this group of boys. Uh, get this bloke here, you're better talking to him. Mate, an extraordinary night, most people didn't think Australia was a chance really coming into it, obviously there was belief in the group though. I, I think it actually freed us up a bit, right. um, coming in underdogs chance to take on the best of the tournament.